Hello, my sweeties. So for today, we're gonna to be doing our letter of the week. Does anyone think they know what our letter of the week is? Think about last week and think what letter we had. It's gonna be the letter that comes after that. So what letter did we learn last week? It looks like this. Do you remember? W. So what letter comes after W? Because that's going to be the letter that we're learning this week. Let's do our ABCs and see if we can figure it out. Are you ready? I want you to sing with me, okay? Here we go. One, two, three. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P. Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X. We are learning letter X today. So I've got our alphabet soup here. Let's see. The letter X looks like this. So it looks like it's just, it's two lines. It goes down and down and they meet each other in the middle. All right, let's see what kind of things we got in our alphabet soup can for our letter X. A lot of things don't start with the letter X. So our pictures in here, they're gonna have the letter X in them. It's just not gonna start with the letter X. Ooh, does anyone think they know what sound the letter X makes? Hmm, what sound does it make? Do you know? If you know, let me hear you. Let me, let me hear you say it. All right, you ready? It makes the k, k, kind of like you're making the K sound and the S sound together. K, everyone go k, k. Good job. And our action, we gotta come up with an action. So like I said, a lot of words don't start with the letter X. They just don't for some reason. But they do. there are a lot of words that have the letter X in the middle or at the end of them. So I thought for our action, we could be like we had an ax. An ax is something that you chop wood with. So we're gonna go like this. We're gonna pretend like our arm is like a piece of wood and we're gonna go x, x, x. I want everyone to do that with me, are you ready? Get your arm ready and we go up and down. Like our arm is the ax and our other arm is the piece of wood that we're cutting. Ready, here we go. X. job. All right, let's see what we've got. Hmm. Ooh, what is this? Does anyone know what this is? It is a car. You are correct. It's a special type of car though. It's not one that you have. You like call the person to come get you and you pay them to drive you somewhere. Do you know what it's called? Usually they're yellow cars. It's a taxi. Everyone say taxi. Good. T a x e. There was that x. X t a x e. Good job. Let's see what else we got in here. Ooh, we all know what this is. What is this? Shout it out. Let me hear you. It's a box. Everyone say box. B a x. There's that x sound, b a x. Good job. Let's see what else we got. Hmm. Let's see what is this. What is this? Do you know what it is? It is an X-ray. X-ray. Everyone say X-ray. Good job. We go X, we say the letter X, and then Ray. All right, let's see. Ooh, this one's an animal. What is this? What is that? It's a type of animal. It's usually orange, but you can come in some different colors too. It is a fox. Everyone say fox. Fox. Now, wait a minute. Fox? 
And we had another one that sounded just like that. What was our other picture that sounded a lot like fox? Was it x-ray, taxi, or box? Which one sounded like fox? Box did fox, box. Those words rhyme because they have the same end sound. They have different beginning sounds. Fox starts with f and box starts with b, but they both have the ox on the end. F, ox, b, ox. That means those words rhyme because they sound the same at the end. Ooh. Okay, now we've got our capital and our lowercase. All right, which one do you think is our capital letter? Take a guess, which one do you think is our capital? Is it this one or is it this one? It's this one. Look how this one's bigger than that one. It's much taller. So this one's the mama and this one's the baby. Look how they look exactly the same. They're just different in size. We've had a lot of letters like that. We've had U, V, W, and now X, that the capital and lowercase look exactly the same, just the capital one is bigger. Wow. All right, so this is a capital one. Now, which one's the lowercase one? Is it this one or is it this one? Point to it. Which one is it? The lowercase. It's this one. The lowercase one is smaller. Good job. Let's do our sound. Ready for our X? We go X, X, X. Good job. All right, I'm going to put all my stuff away in my box, and then we're going to get ready to write the letter X. It is so easy. All right, here we go. Let me get my paper. Okay, to write the letter X, I told you that it's two lines. Now our lines, just like our W and our V, we're not going straight up and down. We're going kind of to the side a little bit, but not all the way to the side, just a little bit. So let me show you, to make an X, we take our pencil, make sure I got enough lead, there we go. We start at the top, we go down, stop. Pick up, go back to the top over here, and we go down and stop, just like that. Now you wanna make sure that your tops start at the same length and your bottoms end at the same length. You don't want one that looks like that and it's way longer than the others. You want them to be the same size. So let's do it again, okay? I'm gonna show you. It's two lines. Start top, go down and stop. Pick up, go back to the top, go down and stop. Good job. You wanna make sure that your lines cross in the middle, that you're not crossing them way up at the top and you're not crossing them way down at the bottom. You wanna make sure it's in the middle. Good job, you guys. And then to make the lowercase x, exact same steps, except it's just smaller, it's shorter. So we're gonna start at the top for a lowercase x. We're gonna go down and stop. Pick back up, go back to the top. Go down and stop. Good job, see how my lowercase one is smaller than my capital one? That's how I want it to be. Good job, guys. So for your activity, I want you guys to practice your X's. I want you to make 10 capital X's and 10 lowercase X's, okay? Oh, let's practice our sound one more time for our X. Get your, get your hands ready, like our wood and our X. We go, job. Remember the letter X looks like this, like um, X marks the spot, an X. All right, guys, good job. Remember to take a picture of your X's and attach it to the Google Classroom so I can see it, okay? All right, I'll see you guys later. Bye.